What is up, everyone? It is Jeremy Dwayne here. I'm here with uh, Padawani. Hey. Uh, we're we're basically giving you guys a one last video, talking about our our opinions on Black Ops. It is a farewell to Black Ops. And yeah, we're we're winging it, and we're just gonna have some fun with this commentary. So you know, what was your thoughts about Black Ops? You know, just your overall opinion on the game. Uh, let's see. When it first came out, it was you know they had all the server issues, but when, when you know when they fixed that, I mean yeah, it had it had its, it, the little bit of weapon balance problems, but I mean overall it was a good game. Um, I mean a lot of people complained about like the knife lunging and shit, but you know they obviously patched it, and I mean you compare it to past Call of Duties, yeah, it's no COD four, mm -hmm. but I mean I'm I'm hoping. Um, Infinity Ward and Sledgehammer kind of take notice to what Treyarch did with at least with the servers in Black Ops to where they they monitored the shit out of those servers. You know, you didn't run into really any hackers, modders, but you know, boosters got reset and stuff like that. Yeah. And it, like if you look at Mono Warfare 2, after three months of the game being out, uh, they just said like, "Hey, okay, we're gonna give you guys free reign on the servers," which is kind of you know kind of stupid. Mm -hmm. But I mean, uh, um, overall, if uh, you know if if Mono Warfare 3 is terrible, I'm going back to Black Ops. Yeah, I think I'm gonna be kind of the same same boat as you. I if it if the game is bad, I'm returning it. <laughs> um, I I just don't see a point in wasting a hundred bucks on a game if it's gonna be terrible. But um, I I was actually a late adopter for Black Ops. I I got it like three months after it had already been out, so I kind of missed all that server issues and all that stuff. But you got lucky. Yeah. I probably would have quit the game a lot sooner. Oh, it was it, it was impossible to get more more than a group of three people into a game without losing someone. Oh wow! Yeah, it was terrible. Yeah, um, I think I think there was some aspects of the game that I didn't like so much. Uh, there, were, like people, just they tryharded way too much in this game, and it was just ridiculous. <laughs> Well, I mean, it's it, it's not even tryharding in, in Black Ops. It's tryharding in um, in any Call of Duty. I mean, back when I played COD Four, like COD Four wasn't it wasn't my first COD game. I think I started way back in the day in my COD Two. But you know, COD Four, mm -hmm. you know, it, it brought it brought in all these new features and, and everyone loved it. You know, class customization. Um, Perks, and then you know it brought in actual more than one kill streak. Because back in COD three and COD two, like tech, like each loadout would get a would get a kill streak. Like the sniper, you would have a mortar, you know, a mortar strike. Mm -hmm. And the, the more kills you got, the, like there were three ranks. So when you start out, you would start at rank one, then you would get to rank two and three. And the you know the higher the rank, the like the faster your your kill streak refreshed itself. And you know that was fun. But then they came out with COD four, and they brought in all this new stuff. And then you know it kind of just went downhill from there. Uh, if you look at like you know, if you look at Black Ops, they did you know they kind of kept it on the same trail as, as COD Four with a couple you know new innovative things like theater, like COD points. I I did I love the COD point system because yeah. it it gave you it gave you better access to guns instead of just being like oh you know here's a gun that that no one uses and we gave it to you because because we needed to. Yeah. And I mean, on on Black Ops, I mean, I haven't played. I have played a couple games here and there in the last month. I think I I, I just hit a million COD points that I I can't spend. <laughs> well, you're also like Prestige 15. <laughs> I've been 15 for like seven months. Yeah, I'm what I'm Prestige I four, and I just got that like last week. <laughs> I've I just did not want to Prestige, but in Modern Warfare 3, I'm gonna go all the way. Yeah, have you figured out um, what you're going to be doing with your prestige tokens? Uh, I know for sure I'm going to be keeping the ACR. <laughs> I love that gun. Um, I I don't know. I mean, I I don't know much about the points and what you can buy. So um, from from what I understand, when like after you prestige for the first time, you'll be prompted with the prestige uh, the prestige shop, and it'll give you like you know uh, keep a weapon high you know level proficiencies faster there's one to get double xp for two hours um extra weapon slots stuff like that mm -hmm. and uh, honestly i'll probably go with the double xp for the first couple just to kind of get ahead of people and then i'll start picking up the extra classes mm -hmm. yeah i have some some of those mountain dew double xp uh, of codes. course you you and your damn mountain dew <laughs> dude i have a mini fridge full of it i have I hate half you. of it is is the original Mountain Dew, and the other half is Game Fuel. I'm I'm ready. 
So what you're saying is you wouldn't mind if I if, if I stopped by tomorrow night? Absolutely, I, I, I would not like mind. And like store your mini fridge. I would love it, dude. But you know, you'd have to you'd have to trench through all the snow over there in Pennsylvania. Is there still like a bunch of snow? Over you should there? see the snow we got here. <laughs> I hate snow. I hate the cold. Go away. Yeah, I'm. I'm. It's still t-shirt weather over here in Wisconsin. So. Oh God, <laughs> you wouldn't. You and the cows. But I mean, what we're looking at, at least for me, 24 hours. So you know, by, by this time tomorrow, I'll be in line waiting to get my grubby little hands on a copy of uh, Modern Warfare 3. Oh yeah, same here. And Jared, well, it's it's 25 for you. Yeah, it's it's just under 25 for me. And you know what? For for you West Coasters, I point my finger and laugh. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna be way behind. I mean, it, it it's it, it's not even that. I mean, pe people already have the game Kmart fuck. Oh right? yeah, that's. Cameras are like, oh, here, we're going to put these out like five days early, and then people have like illegal copies. I mean, I hope, and they've said this every year, because, you know, every year some people always manage to get a copy early. Um, and I know in, um, I know in Black Ops, I believe they reset the servers. Mm -hmm. I, I hope they do it in Mono for 3, because, I mean, I don't care that people got it, get it got it early i just kind of i don't want to be like oh you know go in and boom like hey look fourth prestige yeah oh, that's go. that'll be dumb if people are like way ahead uh i know like some of the some of the uh employees of game like gamestop and places like that i think they get it a little early um they they just steal it yeah. like eh, you won't miss a copy yeah like i work here man i deserve a copy <laughs> Dude, the people like game like at, at least the GameStop I go to, I think there's one two people now that that are that, that actually play like video games. When I used to go there like last year, when, like when I was in high school and stuff, I would go in there. I'd, I would ask them a question, and they they would sit there and stare at me like I had like four heads. <laughs> like they talking about like what like why do you hire these people? Yeah. And then and then you try to get a job there, and they're like, oh sorry, you know we're not hiring. But they, but then they hire these these morons that that can't tell their insert weird analogy that I can't think of. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I really need to get a job there because you know discount on games. What can be or like uh, like Best Buy or something like at least I I I would actually take Best Buy because Best Buy the their stuff uh they, their their prices are actually a little bit better than GameStop mm -hmm. and that like they also sell TVs and stuff. Which oh yeah. Is, oh. TVs, cameras, all that good stuff. But no, um, if you had to pick one thing, what's the one thing in Black Ops that you hated? Oh, that everyone else is better at sniping than I am. Well, the sniping in general in that game is terrible. Honestly, it's like everyone else can get quick scopes, headshots, all this other stuff. I'm sitting here, like it just doesn't work for me, and it's not fair. <laughs> One thing I hated in that game was RC cars. Oh, RC cars. I've gotten. I used it for a little bit, and I actually... I did get a quad with one RC car, and I ran, I, I ramped it off a wall into some dude's face and killed four <laughs> But those things are like, and you you, you cannot run them. I mm -hmm. mean, if, you, if if you have lightweight marathon or like a pistol or something, because in uh, in Black Ops, the, your run speed is based off of the the weapon you have out, not the not your primary weapon, like it was in Modern Warfare Two and stuff. Yeah. And um, it's I mean, I would I I would dolphin that my ass out of a window when I saw one. I'm like, fuck this, <laughs> out of here. And then, you know, you'd be one kill away from whatever kill streak, and you're like, okay, oh here's a go RC car. Okay. Yeah. Right over. All right. Well, that's all we have for today. Um, tomorrow is obviously Modern Warfare 3, so we're gonna be doing a live stream all night. If you could come out and join us, that'd be awesome. It'll be at Twitch.tv/fps. Uh, I will be doing it. Padwani will also be there for most of it. Hopefully, hope you enjoyed the video. Take it easy. Bye. Later, guys.